हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू द चैनल वी आर कंटिन्यूइंग अवर कवरेज ऑफ वैन 2.2 मॉडल व्हिच इज वन ऑफ द प्रीमियर ओपन सोर्स ओपन वेट फ्री मॉडल फॉर टेक्स्ट टू वीडियो और इमेज टू वीडियो जनरेशन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू इंस्टॉल 14 बिलियन साइज पैरामीटर मॉडल वेरिएंट फॉर इमेज टू वीडियो दिस इज फहद मिर्जा एंड आई वेलकम यू टू द चैनल इफ दिस इज अ फर्स्ट टाइम please like the video and subscribe to the channel we already have covered the 5 billion variant for text to video and image to video and also the text to video for 14 billion variant as you can see on the channel so if you are interested in those models please do check them out the tool which i am going to use in order to get it installed is comfy ui if you don't know what comfy ui is just go to my channel search with comfy ui tutorial and download and install it by watching this video and it will also explain all the basic concepts you need to uh, have in order to get this rolling also one very important point if you already have comfy ui installed please please make sure you upgrade it otherwise it is not going to work i am also providing you all the instructions as how to get it installed plus a free comfy ui workflow so just check the video's description I already have it installed and at the moment I am generating this video from text prompt through this workflow while it generates that let me quickly show you the vram consumption so it is consuming uh, close to 35 gig and I have seen it just touching 36 gig and it's the same vram consumption for text to video too now if you're looking to rent a gpu or vm on very very affordable prices as you can see i have this 48 gb of vram in nvidia rtx a6000 you can go to the video's description and get master computes link with a discount coupon of 50% for range of gpus also i want to introduce you to um, agent which is the world's first multi agent workforce desktop application empowering you to build manage and deploy a custom ai workforce that can turn your most complex workflows into automated tasks and you will also find the link in video's description so for installation after you have comfy ui installed after watching that video first thing you need to do is to go to this link and all the links to the models are in also in video's description this is actual model there are two files one is for high noise and one is for low noise so just download it in the models diffusion models directory in comfy ui both of these files as you can see here and then you would need this text encoder which converts your prompt into text description and then just simply right click on any one of them and then just go to comfy ui models and then text encoder then download it here third and final model you would need is variation auto encoder just right click on download save link go to models directory and then go to v or vae directory this is the model which converts your images from latent space to pixel space and vice versa latent space is where model works and pixel space is where you can see the image and then all you need to do put it in your text prompt give it a reference image i have selected this reference image from my local system and i am asking it to generate a video of a cute enemy girl picking up a bow and arrow and moving quickly let's see what it generates we already know that uh, the vram consumption let's check it out again you see it has gone just over 36k and then it stays over there and i have seen that with 14 billion variant it takes around i would say 15 minutes to generate a video a small one for 5 billion it is quite quick so keep that in perspective while it generates that video let's talk slightly bit more about this model because i think they have done wonderfully well here so you see it is a mixture of expert model and it can uh, transform your static static images into dynamic coherent videos by separating the denoising process across time stamps using specialized expert models and this mixture of expert architecture as you can see on your screen allows for increased model capacity without significantly impacting inference cost as it actively Uh, activates only the relevant experts during each step of the diffusion process so by focuses on by focusing on different aspect of video generation such as overall layout and fine details this model ensures stable and realistic video output with redu reduced unrealistic camera movement 
and you can uh, generate the resolutions for 480p and 720p so it can be used for various applications from academic research to even industrial use cases i think if you really really put some effort there anyway let's wait for it to uh, generate this and then we will check it out what exactly it does and one more point is that if you are interested in benchmarking i'm also planning to do a comparison video uh, very soon so stay tuned but if you look at this diagram you can see that it has either beaten or it is very close and neck to neck competition with various leading models in terms of quality efficiency and flexibility and they have also shared some of the gpus if you are looking to run it easily and you can see that this is the same experience which i am having at the moment and of course if you would increase the resolution your vram consumption will increase so please keep that in perspective okay so i'm just going to wait now and then see what it does and there you go it has created the video wow look at this how good is that let me make it a bit bigger and i'll play it so you see it is in focus and it is it has just converted it and of course you can play around with the prompt and make it a bit better but looks quite good so the thing which i really like that it has really caught my um, image perfectly well very nice okay let's try out another one so first i'm just going to give it a prompt that and i'll show you the image which i'm going to use from my local system so i have selected this image after clicking on this choose file to upload and then the prompt is that a romantic wedding day montage featuring the couple sharing tender moments exchanging vows under a canopy of flowers and dancing joyfully as sunlight filters through the trees let's see how it goes again it is going to take 15 minutes and you can see that this is where we are specifying the model um, all the text encoders the diffusion models the v models in their respective nodes and then this is where scheduler and samplers are being specified so you know scheduler controls how noise is gradually removed from the latent image whereas sampler affects quality speed and style of output image as i mentioned earlier if you are interested in learning more about this latent and all that stuff just start with latent and i have done very easy to understand video as what exactly is meant by this latent space so i will again wait for 15 minutes and then once it generates a video i will present it to you so let's wait for it and there you go it has generated the video i will let you be the judge i think it has done wonderfully well um, and by the way these are all AI generated images and there you go you see um, I think it has the thing which I really like about this model is that it is keeping the spirit of the image which is always a good idea and it is quite an you know um, safe model so don't worry too much about it you can see that it didn't really go uh, beyond a limit which is always good for these safe models and Quinn's models and Alibaba's models are normally safe so is this van one that's it please like the video and subscribe to the channel and if uh, you would share it among your network i would be very very grateful thank you for all the support